Hey guys, it's Super Chase here with part 52. Um, I, last time he sent out a Marowak and I faked you guys out by saying, Oh no, I'm in trouble! And um, believe me, I wasn't. So, uh, finally defeated the first guy in here. So, and it can fly. Okay, you faked me out. Probably now. Yeah, about 20 times with that. <gasps> You're evolving? You're not. Give it up. You're not tricking me anymore. The leader will scold me for losing this way. Okay, and another guy you have to fight is this guy. So, I just come up here. I'm the Karate King. Your fate rests with me! And believe it or not, he has fighting Pokemon. Fighting type Pokemon. So, um... Guess who I put out front? Smart, smart me I am. You all thought I was gonna say uh, I can fly. It can't fly, didn't you? Well, I left Cyclone out there because I'm an idiot. Um, I'm gonna try avoid use avoid using Cyclone in this gym, partly because you can't do much to the Pokemon because not all of them are ground type. Believe me, there are lots of fighting and poison type in here too. Um, and by the time I'll come to the gym leader, I'm hoping to not use Cyclone as much because I don't want him to become that over leveled for the rest of the team. And oh, geez, that could really hurt me. Luckily, it'll hurt him too. Okay, I'm weak to fighting type moves, so yeah, not the smartest cookie in the jar. And level 43. Okay, that was really stupid. I'll never do that again. Oh, safeguard. Okay. Um, let's see. Okay, long story short here. Basically, safeguard was on my original plan. I was going to get rid of rain dance for it. It would be great. Safeguard protects the all of your Pokémon for 5 turns from status conditions. And I was thinking, well, Rain Dance actually helps me out lately, so I might keep it. And I was thinking and thinking and thinking, um, could you buy Safeguard? And I was thinking, I think that's only Hoenn, so I said, no, but oh well. And then I'm like, you know what, screw it, let's just teach it because I have a Rain Dance TM, or I could just use those, um, mushrooms to the move tutor on an island coming up. So, that's just about the long and the short of that little sped up bit. Okay, and Machoke, you are so gone. It's not even funny. That's not funny. Critical hit, too. Isn't it nice to have a resistance to fighting time moves? Anyway, um... Pretty much, yeah. Uh, f uh, the, 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 the... Safeguard's a decent move, I guess. Ah, yeah! Safeguard... It can come in handy. And hey, I can always teach Rain Dance back. And now that he's blocking the way, I'll quickly show you how to get to the gym leader now. If you just want to take the quick way, which I don't recommend because you need the experience, believe me. Gym leader's right there. He's walked down, but I'm not going to. I'm going to go heal. See you guys in a minute. Okay, now that we're back, I'm going to show you all the optional trainers, be but they're going to be sped up because they're optional and you really don't have to do them. It's a shame there won't be much more narrating in this part because I'm going to put it to music. I just fixed my mic, meaning I put more duct tape on it. But oh well, I got some really odd out there tunes for you guys to listen to. Lots of battles, and let's go.
now that we've finished every single battle in the eighth gym, um, I might put up like what each song was, the name of each song. I might put it up on like scrolling across the screen right now as I speak. Anyway, let's head into the eighth and final gym of the Kanto region. Oh, well, I'm making it sound more epic than it really is, honestly. You have to fight that guy. And you have to fight that guy. And let's find out who the leader. What? Is that even legal? No. Oh. What? 